little bit of history of this piece, so we know what we're uh, what we the what we're continuing on. You know, this was Rodgers and Hammerstein's follow-up to Oklahoma. They were quite concerned with that follow-up. What would that be? Because Oklahoma was such a smash. Um, they found this play, or they were this play was brought to them by. Uh, Molnar, who's a Hungarian writer, and it was done in Budapest in 1909. Not successful. Uh, revived after World War I, hugely successful. So then he was, the playwright was petitioned many times to turn the play into something else. Puccini wanted to turn it into an opera. He refused. Uh, Kurt Weill wanted to turn it into a musical. He refused. Uh, Rodgers and Hammerstein were very keen on it, but they also knew that he was saying no to everybody. So what they did was, they were clever, and arranged the meeting with him at the theater after Oklahoma. So he saw the show first, so he sat through the show, and then they met backstage after the show. And he said to them, if you can do with Lillian what you did with that, then it's yours. So he gave it to them then. The play is very much like this play except that ending when, when Billy goes back and he slaps Louise, um, that's the end for him. So there is no redemption and he goes to purgatory or hell or, so it's quite tragic. With no comfort and at least no, I mean currently it is still a tragedy, but there's a, it's a tragedy with hope at the end. There's hope that Louise doesn't live the life he lived. So though it's still a tragedy, again, the, the, the ray of hope, and, and we need to bring that out, don't we? That's, we do want, we want to bring that part out.